I'm looking for my first demonstrator fountain pen. Any recommendations? Pilot Prera, Twisby, who knows? Okay, uh, I think Twisby is a great place to start. I really do because they're they're uh, an affordable brand. You know, they they developed the whole line to be a great price, so that makes it a really great intro level pen. So I have here the Twisby Eco Lime, which is their most recent color they've come out with. Maybe isn't the color for everybody, but they've got a clear and a black one and a white one, so definitely worth checking those out. I think it's a phenomenal pen for the money. It's a piston filling pen for under thirty dollars. Really well made, writes reliably. I definitely think this is one worth checking out. Um, but if you don't like that particular style, there's, you know, they've got the 580, they've got the mini. This is the mini right here. So this is also piston filling, $50. Really good value as well. They have some decent nib options on these as, as well. But really any of the Twizy pens, they're all kind of in that range of prices around the, you know, the Eco is the cheapest. The rest of them kind of hover around 50 and then there's a the VAC, which is a little bit more. But really I'd recommend any of them. They're all in a demonstrator version. So definitely those ones are worth checking out. Um, uh, let's see here. The Prera, sure. You got the. You mentioned the Prera in there, so this is going to be a little over the fifty dollar range. Um, if you like the Pilot Metropolitan and the way that pen writes, but you want something a little lighter and you want to be able to see your ink level, the Prera really is a good way to go. It's quite a bit more than the Metropolitan, even though the nib uh, is basically the same. It writes identically, uh, but if you want all the rest of those features, the Prera is uh, worth checking out for you. Some other good ones to recommend. Um, the Lamy Vista, so it's basically a clear Lamy Safari. Uh, very reliable writer, very popular pen, you know, demonstrator, you get to see all the innards and really good stuff. Workhorse pen, writes really nicely. Um, Nemesign is a newer brand that we've been carrying, but they have a pen called the Singularity, which comes in clear as well as a number of clear uh, demonstrator, sorry, demonstrator tinted colored uh, demonstrator pens. So this is a good one to check out. Cool thing about this one too is it's eyedropper convertible, so you can have some fun with that. Um, and so you can kind of go nuts there, get some decent ink capacity. And then you got some Noodler's pens too. If you want a flex nib, you got the Ahab, the Conrad, the uh, nib creeper. So those ones are, are worth checking out if you want something. They're all very affordable uh, price range. The the demonstrator aspect of it, they're a little foggier because it's a different type of resin that's used on these than some of these other ones. Um, so it's got a little bit of yellow tint to it and um, it shows scratches easier, but it's also very, very durable. You can like run over a truck with these things. Uh, run it over with a truck. You can't run over a truck with a pen. But you get what I'm saying. So that one is kind of worth checking out. So um, lots of good options here for you, I think, for good demonstrators. These are all in pretty affordable price ranges. I think the most expensive one is really the Prera. Um, but uh, all solid ones that I think you can have a good time with.